So I'm working on another sign, and I'm going to try a technique that I don't think I've seen anybody use. Uh, later on. Well, my idea is to actually... I don't know if you guys can see that, but those are all little eighth inch holes, registration marks, that are going to line up with the letters that I'm going to be cutting out. And you can see I'm going to be cutting the letters out in reverse so I can cut them from the back side so I can put the same exact registration holes into the letters and then I'm going to put eighth inch dowels. Just everything should line up just like that. We'll see if it works or not. I'll keep you updated. So since this is a double-sided sign, it's twice as many letters, I'm going to make sure I seal all these up, paint them, attach them to the backing, and then seal everything up even more for the Nevada weather. So here is how this whole thing works. Again, the CNC drilled registration holes into the back side of every letter. And take these little kitchen skewers, cut them into little dowel rods, slide them in. And then the CNC also put the registration marks mirrored horizontally onto the backer board. So it slides right in to So here's the deal. Me and the client had a misunderstanding about the design. The white letters actually need to be black and the background needs to be brown. So I'm gonna change it and that's what's happening. <laughs>